Let's move on here. Uh, what does no hookups mean when you hear it? No hookups means. What Do we know what that? Like no so, hookups, like we don't. So people will say, like in the dating world these days, they'll say they're looking for blah blah blah, and then they'll always say no hookups. Do you know what, what does that, that means? Mean? What does no hookups? Yeah, mean? you need to school me on that one. <laughs> well, I guess I guess they're implying that they don't. <laughs> Go ahead, tell them, Linda. What does no hookups mean? No booty or something? <laughs> no, I, I'm, a, I'm assuming no hookups means no one night stands, no getting together just for sex. I want a relationship. That's what I interpret it as. But it could have. Right. That makes sense. Meaning. You're looking for more. No, that's that's what it is. That's right. what it is. But so I was in another group and, and and they were talking about that no hookups, you know, and so. Okay, so, so anybody want to speak first, and then because I'm gonna be brutal, and then you're gonna probably not like me. Okay. <laughs> you're probably not gonna like. Me. Well, maybe we need that edge right now, so we can all start to give our okay. input. Okay. So there's these girls in this other group that I'm in, and they're like, you know, talk about these guys they're looking for, and then they always say no hookups. So, I mean, when I see that. First of all, anytime somebody volunteers and says that what they don't want, I mean, who does that? I don't do that. If I say I'm looking, for, I'll say I'm looking for X, Y, and Z, and it's things I'm looking for. I don't tell you things I'm not looking for. I'm not going to tell you I'm not looking for a drug addict. I'm not looking for <laughs> uh, a prostitute. I'm not looking, you know, I'm not going to tell you things I'm not looking for. So, so when maybe I hear that. Maybe they've met so many of them that want, wanted nothing more than just a hookup. So they're putting it right out there. Why not ask for what you want? I don't want a one-night stand. I don't want any of that. I want a substantial relationship. I want some st substance to my relationship. Yeah, something serious. There's nothing wrong with putting it out stand. there. So if you're looking well, for a relationship, hit me up. If you're looking for a hookup or a one-night stand, walk bye on bye. bye, boys. Just, <laughs> okay, so do you think if a guy hears that, he's going to say, okay, I'm not... Okay, say say it was a guy that he was just trying to get one night stands playing the field. Is he... If you said, oh, I don't want... I don't want no hookups. You think he's going to say, okay, then, okay, I'm, I'm, I just want to hook up, so I'm not going to talk to you. No. <laughs> I've met so many that that will just start saying all the stuff. They read you like that, and they find yeah, out exactly what you're looking yeah, for, what you're not, and then they start playing towards that to exactly. get in your pants. So I, I kind of think that is a mute point to say that in the beginning. Just don't, think about just don't sleep with them in the beginning, and think they'll move it. on. How many guys are going to be on a dating site that just want a one night stand. They can go to a bar and get a one night stand. Yeah, but on a dating a dating site, you got a million people to choose from. You can hook up all day long. <laughs> it's at your fingertips. It's easy. Yeah, but most people yeah. get on a dating site to find a relationship, to develop a relationship. If they want a one night stand, odds are they aren't going to be on a dating site. They're going to be at a bar. The culture okay. today promotes hookups. So it just, sucks. So now it's, the, it's the special people that are saying no hookups. It's the people who really want something, you know, solid and, and meaningful. So um, this is yours right there. You know, there's a lot of people fighting what, what what's being uh, uh, what what society is trying to dictate. So um, so I think that's why they say no hookups. And, just don't I mean real people don't want hook, just hookups and you know most guys Ooh. the young ones and stuff, they're, huh? they're, in, they're in the playing field they just want to play and women women are more serious about you know their time because yes shorter we have a shorter window to make things happen for us I mean there are exceptions right. but Guys have a longer, they can go from, they can start from their 20s and go through their 80s to find mm -hmm. someone, you know. But women, we have a shorter window to um, find that special mm -hmm. person. True. You want to chime in, Annie? 
I'm, I'm not really, I don't care either way. No hookups doesn't really, I don't <laughs> really care. It's like, if you're telling me what you want and what you don't want, great. That eliminates you from, either eliminates you from my pool or puts you in my pool and doesn't waste my time. Good for you. Oh, baby. <laughs> yeah. She okay, so now one. now Don't you, you got... look great after having a baby. <laughs> oh, there he is. <laughs> look at that. Now I'm going to make you guys mad at me. Okay. Oh, God, here we go. So, the girls that, and there's a lot of them that do that, they say no hookups. To me, that just implies if you're going to tell me what you don't want right off the bat, you don't want no hookups. To me, that means that, first of all, that means you obviously hooked up a lot of times. No, it doesn't. No. You wouldn't be because no. you, you wouldn't be mad. It you might be mean mad. that you ran to a lot of guys who wasted your time because that's all they yes. were after. Yeah, exactly. exactly. Okay, or or that, or that, or that, or that. So that means that basically, okay. To me, here's how relationships work: when you meet somebody in a dating site or however you meet them, uh, you're either a match or you're not. So if you're if you're if you're here and the other person's here. <laughs> Then you're you're they're they're like higher than you, higher value than you, and you're down here. Then if you if you try to go after this person, chances are they're not going to want to stay with you. So it's going to be a hookup. If it's the other way around, or if, unless you're matched, that's how you don't get a hookup. That when you find somebody that's a match for you, that's when you're going to find a relationship. If you're chasing somebody that. You know, if you're if you're down here and they're way up here, they're like six foot tall, look <laughs> like a model, sculptured and all this and that, and and they make a million dollars a year, and you you know you don't have nothing to offer, then you think he's good. He's gonna probably just hook up with you. Well, so if you the, think the, if you think that and you feel that, then maybe you shouldn't hook up with anybody. If you're gonna well, judge not talk somebody by their looks or how much money they make or what kind of job they've got and you think they're too high above you then no yeah. I'm, i think i think you misunderstood me what i'm saying is if you find somebody that's not a match for you meaning if, if you know if somebody's like if somebody's like less attractive than you if you're the more attractive and, and you have more to offer than they do chances are that person's going to stay with you if you're matched then they're going to probably stay with you but if you pick somebody that's way out of your league then they're probably not going to stay with you long. I think then that's good. You no, dodged the bullet. I didn't misunderstand you. <laughs> you didn't? <laughs> yeah, because I think, I think opposites do attract. And I think if somebody is looking for such, like, those kind of things to me are important. What's important Which is... Which kind of things? Like, um, how they look, uh, what kind of money, how much money they bring in, things like that. You, you to me say are, that, but are with a, a lot of people, it's very important. I mean... Most women, okay, so, I mean, these are statistics. These are real statistics. Most women, no, these are statistics. I'm not just making this up. Most You're women. You're saying women want a provider. They want a good-looking provider. Well, and, and that's fine. And that's fine. That's natural. I think, that's exactly. Natural. I think yeah. that's normal. That is normal. That is normal. I'm not saying that it's not normal. Okay, but what, but what they want, they want somebody over six foot tall. They want somebody that that's in shape they want somebody that makes good money a provider like you said that's what they want first of all there's very few this it's not only 20 percent of men that's over six foot tall so you've already eliminated you made that window small a majority <laughs> of the men that's available and then the other people that are over six foot tall they're probably already if you're six foot tall got good money and look good they probably already have somebody so they're either cheating on their wife or, you know, th the point is, if you if you're looking for that, those are the women that, and they won't they won't take nothing less. Then the guy's gonna, yeah, he's gonna. A, a guy will sleep with an ugly chick all day long, whether he, right? I'm not talking about her, but she has a friend that we know mutual person that that <laughs> this girl is like. <laughs> You know, you wouldn't think anybody would do anything with her. But anyway, when so you're thirsty, <laughs> the point is that, right, that guys. most most guys, you know, they don't care what you look like. If the, if it's just a one night stand, if it's a hit and quit, they don't care. But 
if they want to stay with you as, in a relationship, then yeah, you have to be at least equal to them. But if you're equal or below them, you know, then they're they're not going to stay around. I'm telling you the truth. That's what it is. I, <laughs> I don't think that, do you? But you don't think that, Gavin? Yeah, but do you really think that? Which part? I keep telling them that's not true because the right woman won't look at those little small qualities, you oh, know? To which, me, that's not important. That doesn't make a relationship last. Uh, okay. It's stupid on her part to even go there like no, that. 